What is going on people? Welcome back to the channel guys. Today we are doing a little fishing video for y'all. We're out here at the spillway which is currently not producing any water. But we still got a good little puddle down here. It's a runoff from uh, Lake Palestine. It runs off all the way down here. And it runs down here into a few channel of creeks and stuff. So really good pockets down here to catch some really really nice good sized fish. So all I'm taking today is three uh, rods. I'm taking my uh, Carolina rig with my ribbon tail worm 10 inch. I'm taking my white half ounce chatterbait and I'm taking my little crappie rig set up just in case there's some crappie down here in this puddle, which I really hope there is. But I think one of my key baits today is gonna be the white chatterbait. One, because the water here is very dirty and there's very low visibility. So that white bait is gonna really stand out to all these like predator fish and stuff like that. So I have a really, really good feeling about it today. And it's a really sketchy walk down there, guys. It's kind of a drop off, so we have to be very careful on our way down there. So let's get to fishing, guys. I'm excited. This is steep. I'm gonna have to try not to die here. There we go. All right, we are here. Made it. Big. Oh, 
don't know what this is. But it's big. Oh my gosh, guys. Are y'all on? I don't know what the heck this is, but it's big. Hit it like a freaking freight train. I hope that is a huge wiper, but I don't think it is. I think I hooked a carp. Can't tell. Big old catfish, big old catfish on the chatterbait, guys. That is insane. Y'all aren't gonna believe this. I'm gonna have to bring him up here, hold on. <laughs> we'll get out of here. Yeah, it's a catfish on a chatterbait. <laughs> Just throwing a white chatterbait and he got it. <laughs> that is crazy. Okay. Yeah, I'm probably going to keep him. <laughs> Dad, gum. Oh. <laughs> That is insane. On that, the chatterbait caught this giant. <laughs> that is wild. That's crazy. I couldn't do that again if I tried. Wow. Uh, I think it's up. Yeah, flathead. Blue flathead? Yeah, that's a flathead. Yeah. I've never caught a flathead before. Really? <laughs> yeah, really. That's a dark one, too. Not a bad one. <sighs> Man, when he hit it, I was really praying that it was a giant wiper or something. <laughs> I was like, oh, please let it be a wiper. You catch a lot of fish down here usually? Uh, crappie, uh, white bass, and uh, wiper. They uh, migrate here through like uh, a uh, white bass and a striped bass uh, mixed together. They're just real thick and they're yeah. about that big. They, they come through here with the white bass around February to like April. They're running. Okay. I've never, I fished Lake Palestine a bunch, but I've never been down here. Oh, it's a great little spot. <laughs> Hi guys. Here is that big flathead. Just a giant, huge fish. Man, I don't know how big he is. This is huge. Huge fish. Look at that mouth. That vacuum of a mouth. It is just giant. I've never seen a blue flathead before, so if you know why this one's blue, please leave in the comments. I sure would love to know why, but he is an amazing, amazing fish. Look how fat he is. Big boy. Ah.
yeah giant catfish and you can see we're out here at the spillway and a uh, big shout out to uh, whoever made this rock thing you are a legend for that because i did not have a stringer for that fish and uh, the bucket i brought i don't think it's going to fit him but he is definitely going to be dinner tonight so it's going to be absolutely amazing that is insane here let me show you what i caught him on this right here it is a one ounce white chatterbait with the white fluke as a tail and i was just fishing that hitting the rocks bumping it off the rocks he absolutely inhaled it i thought it hooked a uh, carp or something because it was so heavy but absolutely wild guys insane one of the craziest catches of the year by far huge flathead on a white chatterbait end of story All right, guys, so I've been here for about two and a half hours now. That flathead was the only thing I've caught, which I'm perfectly okay with. It's starting to get a little warmer in the day, and I'm wearing a hoodie for God knows what reason, and I'm sweating over here. But uh, came down here to this little spot too, uh, shallow creek, really good current. Tried to fish it, no bites at all. It's here about 30, 45 minutes. Not even a sign of life, no uh, bait chases, blow ups, nothing like that. So we're gonna call it an end to this. I am really surprised about catching that flathead here at the spillway that is complete just bl blows my mind i was not expecting that at all i was pretty much expecting everything else but that but it's perfectly fine i'll take it that is awesome i haven't been on the spillway in a long time so after coming down here and catching that definitely 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 plan to come down here again guys i really hope you enjoyed the video i really hope you enjoyed that awesome flathead catch what a fight guys that was awesome but anyway, I really hope you all enjoyed the video. Please make sure to like and subscribe to the Dark Little Action channel, guys. Hit that notification bell so you can get alerted as soon as more awesome videos just like this drops. I don't know why I haven't you done it yet. Need to do it. <laughs> guys, I will catch you on the next one. Peace.